how to fix Fortnite Windows can't access specific device. If you're facing this issue recently in Fortnite OG, here are steps that you can do in order to fix this problem. First and foremost, what you have to do is make sure when you're opening Epic Games Launcher, when we're having the Epic Games Launcher, you go to the Epic Games Launcher directory, you can see over here that is Program Files, Epic Games Launcher, Portal Binaries, Win32. And you're going to select the Epic Games Launcher, right click on this and make sure you click on Run as Administrator. Once the Epic Launcher opens, then you run Fortnite, see if that helps. Even if you have a desktop icon of Epic Games Launcher, in the desktop icon, right click on the Epic Games Launcher, simply click on Run as Administrator see if that helps. Next step what you can do is you have to go to your Fortnite directory and in your Fortnite directory you have to go to Fortnite game binaries win64 and then scroll down you have to find the Fortnite application you have to find the one which is the highest one that is as you can see the highest number over here this is the application which you have which you have to select right click go to properties and over here first thing what you have to do is you have to go to the security options over here and you have to click on all these options which you can see that is the usernames simply select all of them at once i would recommend you to first select the administrator one you have to click on edit make sure you allow full control and click apply click ok do the same thing for every single one for the system is already allowed authenticated users click as you can see fully controlled users in the desktop fully controlled as well so simply click ok click ok once you have given full control try running the game see if that helps next step that you can do is you have to come into a fortnite directory and over here you have to open fortnite game simply delete this binaries folder once you have deleted the folder come back open the engine folder there also a binaries folder will be there simply click on this permanently delete it once you have deleted both the files you have to open your epic games launcher you have to go to your library section scroll down and you have to find fortnite and once you delete both the files you will see a word called as a repair just over here simply click on this three dots click on manage and you will find a word called as verify or repair simply click on that it will simply download all the deleted files and if any corrupted files are present it will re-download them then you launch the game see if that helps Lastly, what you can do is in your Fortnite directory that is in the Fortnite game binaries and win64, right click on the application which, which is the highest size, go to properties, click on compatibility, choose run this program as administration and click apply, click OK and then launch your game, see if that helps. So those were the steps in order to fix this problem. If you're still having the issue, don't forget to comment down in the comment section. If this video helped you, please don't forget the like button, consider subscribing, hit the bell icon. I'll see you in the next video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.